There we go. He is really not liking this tonight. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna reload. There we go, finally. Let's go. Okay, I'm going to give this uh, last chance and if nothing, I'm just going to give up tonight. Anyways, I was saying before stream got rudely interrupted again that I've been playing a lot of the Skull and Bones at the moment from Ubisoft. It's not actually a bad game. I mean, yeah, fair enough. It took a long time to come out and they had so many developers working on it. Which was frustrating to wait for. I know it's not going to be. Oh, it doesn't look as pretty as we had hoped, but it is a good game. I'm enjoying it. You know, I'm always finding something to do on there. Between 5 a.m. and 2 p.m. Fuck's sake, really? So now what? Funny man. Let's go and see Funny Man and then we'll um, skip time. Hmm. 
Uh, I don't know what it is tonight, it's not behaving. Which is quite frustrating. You look like you could use some assistance. Gracias, amigo. The pendejos killed two of my men and captured another. We must save him. When are you sending the men out to fight? If you the proximo. Right there will be through. Huh. Here we go. Oh, okay, weren't expecting that. Cuidado, there are more in this town ready to fight. Muévete, cabrón. You shouldn't play with guns, fellas. Oh, he's still alive. Who do you think you are? Huh? Manda ayuda, señor. You gave her a gun. I think they're holding my compadre in this house. You know how this is going to end. There you go. Almost shot him instead, actually. Bug on. Hmm. 
Oh, he's up there, is he? You've arrived in the nick of time. Huh. Him again. Oh, go on then. Boy, am I glad to see you. Damn sport. You really are someone to be riding the river with. I think you've done outstayed your welcome down these parts, old Jimmy. <laughs> I'd get out while the going's good. Oh, you're right about that. There is something about nearly dying several times that hasn't given the old muse the kick up the backside that I was expecting. I can't write a joke for a pile of fresh turd. No more of this cowboy business for old Jimmy. I think I might take up music. Or war reporting. <laughs> Don't worry, you know. I'll be leaving your primordial land forthwith. See you again soon, Jimmy. Good lord. Nice. Thirteen dollars. I'm just picking up ammo. I gave up looting ages ago, to be honest. I think a week ago. Too much time to pick up stuff for nothing. What's the time of this? Go back to the house. Because then it's about uh, six ish in the game time. Oh shit. Oh fuck. There we go. So, yeah, it's about one o'clock. So, hopefully, get back there now and they will be ready. Should take that. Shouldn't take that long now. Let's go. Like I've already said, I'm giving Twitch one more chance for tonight. And if it stops again, I'm just going to give up and try again next week. I don't like to cut things short, but we're an hour and a quarter in, and already I'm on the third stream.
<clears throat> oh, watch out. Oh shit, wolves. Right, just go a little while away. So, I'm just going to quickly take a break. And hopefully, just keep an eye on the stream for a bit as well. Um, have a look about. I shall be back soon when this gets ready to start.
There we go, 5 a.m. <coughs> Finally, got back just in time. No pesa mucho. Está bien, mamá. Está bien. No. No. Ah, señor Marston. Mamá, papá. Este es el gringo que me salvó. Muchas gracias. Uh, my family is indebted to you. Forgive my English. What's happening? Great and terrible things. The revolution is coming. The country will be in turmoil once more. This time, we hope it's the last time. Does that seem likely? With Abraham Reyes, anything is possible. Where's your family going? My parents and my brother are headed to the hills. My sister has to flee. The army have an unfortunate way of treating women. And you? Don't worry about me, Mr. Marston. I'm living in history. I'm not afraid to die. Your nobility is almost as affecting as your naivete. I would rather be dead than a cynic like you, Mr. Marston. <laughs> I know you're not really like that. You saved me. Oh, Luisa, ¿quién va a salvar a Miranda? Tenemos que llevar al puerto su barco sale al anochecer. No queda tiempo. Mr. Marston, can I ask one more favor of you? Can you take my sister to the docks? We are sending her to work for a kind man in the Yucatan. She's too young for revolution. Okay. Anything I can do to help out? The boat leaves at sundown. Miranda. Vamos. Oh, adiós, Miranda. Ten cuidado. Adiós. Te amo. <coughs> Emilio works as a driver. We will take his stage coach. Oh. Mm, okay. Take this stage coach. <clears throat> oh. A horse horse. Four horse stage. Let's go before I change my mind. Go, 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 go. Now we're racing against the clock. Ooh, it's a bit rocky. Are we? Papeles! Este camino está prohibido. What do they want now? Act normal. It's nothing to worry about. Te conozco. Eres un pinche rebelde. Disparen! No les dejen escapar! Keep going! Go, go, go! Ow! Oh, fuck. Why are we going into the revolution? Wouldn't have been better to go away. We must be careful to avoid the army or they will kill us both. They were actual army guys. I see more of them. Go right here. No, what's the man? Go, 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 go. Coming through. Oh, 
Right, let's get them some stamina back. Whoa. I'll just... Can I get a fucking gun out? No, I can't. Go, go. Keep going. Fucking hell. They are desperate. Go, go, go. What? No, they're not. Right, let's get out of here. I'm hoping this is not much further. Don't let them stop us now. We are nearly there. Get out of here. There we go. We made it in time. Thank you for everything. Will I see you when I return? Not likely. I ain't planning on staying very long. In some other life, then. Maybe. You should get going. Travel safely. Ah, oh, my horse is here. Why don't you run past me? So yeah, I went all the way there to come back. Actually, you know what? I'm going to be nice and take the stage back with me. Yeah, Mum. Sure, Miss Planus Arthur. Really, really love this character. <clears throat> it was just very well written. Whoa! <clears throat> I don't think John would, in this one was written as well as he was in. Red Dead 2. I'm not clearing that out again. These wheels look as if they're going to come off any moment. You won. Now let me go. No.
I've left. I can't wait to see what um, Red Dead Three um, comes up with. I mean, there's so much you can want from the series, but could they go a bit further back in time, like a younger John and a younger Arthur? I think that's maybe the best we're going to see. Or even a young Dutch or Hosea. Now that would be interesting. Going around, helping Arthur out, who is a little upstart, you know. Rescuing John. And just forming the game. Almost ran over a goat. Oh shit! Oh. Um. Pretty sure I left that house standing. Not too long ago. Oh, Mr. Marston! Mr. Marston! What's wrong, Louisa? I don't weep for myself, but for my country. Abram Reyes has been captured. He has? He was coming to meet me at Roca Madera. It's a very romantic spot. It was a beautiful night. And he was ambushed by patrol. My heart is breaking, but I cry for Mexico. Uh, where is he being held? El Presidio. You know, in our hearts, we are married already. But his family do not approve. How could they? <laughs> well, I'm little more than a peasant girl. But that's what makes Abram the man he is. He doesn't care for their bourgeois, snobbery, or elitism. He sees the real me, the woman. I'm sure. I'm going to go and rescue him or die trying. Oh, well, well, I don't think that's such a good idea. Ride with me to near the jail. We'll figure out how to rescue him. Mr. Marston, you're truly a friend of this land. So everyone keeps informing mm -hmm. me. El Presidio is to the north. We must hurry. Who knows what they will do to him? Oh, okay. Um. Only a two horse one this time. Not as quick. Nice easy ride to wherever we need to go. L something. Well, good news is the stream is stabilised, finally, touch wood. I'll skip this, there's not as much talk in there, there we go. It is not far now. Are you ready? El 
Ayo. Oh, Presidio. There is a partially broken down wall. You should be able to scramble over it. Hurry, but please be careful. There are guards everywhere. If they see you, they will kill you both. Well, if he's alive, I'll try to make sure he stays that way. Good luck. You can do this. You have God on your side. Mm, I wouldn't exactly say I have God on God by my side, but. Okay, into sniping. Fuck, I'm down. <laughs> well, that was um, that was a good start. Right, let's make sure they don't get a decent chance. Ooh, son of a bitch. I'll just keep down a little longer. Oh fuck. Ooh. Finally, he's fucking dead. Three left. It's like a game of whack a mole. They're all fucking dead now. Oh shit. Let me just Victoria. Now please come be free, Senor. Luisa sent me. We have to meet her by the river. Yeah? Luisa, the girl you're marrying. Oh yes, such a devoted thing. El amor de mi vida. Get one of those horses. I will ride with you, compadre. Well, I saved them the second time. Come on. I can't ride all the way back to them. Let's go, my friend. Before the army returns. Oh fuck, they were army, not revolutionaries. He's part of the rebels. Oh. 
Okay. Um, I think I'm going to have to turn around here and go back. Let's <laughs> stay with the guide. Yeah. Got left behind. Vamos, let's hurry to Luisa. Oh, let's go. Uh, let's get a full gallop on. <laughs> How do you know my young lover, Laura? It's Luisa. I saved her life not so long back. I will not forget this, compadre. You will be rewarded. Money, women, and Luisa if you want her. I'm here for two men. That's it. You'll be spending too much time with Captain De Santa. Very funny. Not like that. I'll explain later. <laughs> I am free again. I will write a poem about this day. This is from a man who was tied to a post with a gun in his face a few minutes ago. I wish I could see I did this face when he finds out that I defeated a hundred of his men. All you've done is get on the back of this horse, my friend, and you barely manage that. <laughs> this guy we likes to... Suerte, this guy likes to blow a lot of smoke. Abraham, Mr. Marston, Oy. the revolution will live on thanks to you. Yes, indeed, John. You are as a brother to me. And my people need a man such as you to help our cause. My ranch is in Agave Viejo, and let me say, my brother, that we await you. Well, best of luck to both of you, but I need to find two men so I can return to America. Mm, no problem. I will help you find those men, and in return, you will win a people her freedom. Viva Mexico! La Barona de Tuba, bella. Bye, John. Vete conmigo. Tú sabes que en esta luz puedo ver el fuego en tus ojos. Laura! Dame la fuerza para luchar. Luisa. Hooray. Where's my horse? Ah, dickhead's just come back up again. Uh, I really can't wait to get back over to this side. Feels fucking weird. Come on, horse. <sighs> sit back, sit and drink.
someone took his wagon. Full moon out tonight. So I'm uh, wondering what series to cover next. Um, debating on that at the moment. I'm going to have to start looking into that. To see where I'm going to go next with um, Thingy. Because I'm pretty sure I'm coming up the halfway into this one. Yeah, uh, I'm not going to keep stopping for people. I'll have to deal. Here we are. Finally. That's fine. Stream's still going strong. Which is awesome. I think Twitch has sort of sorted itself out. It's a shame about earlier, to be quite honest. Right. Now, is this dickhead going to give me what I want? Seriously? Come here, horse. Come on. Good job I've got a save point nearby. Horses ain't adventurous on this one as they are in number two. There we go. Just go. Here we go again. <clears throat> yeah. 
Well, let's get back there. <clears throat> get get better. Give me what I want. Take out awake. Good. <clears throat> Your master. Good news. Good news. The coronel himself wants to speak to you. Come. Dame lo, dame lo, besito, besita. Don't be so conventional. Ah, look at that ass, huh? Magnificent. Not save her for later, or I'll kill her and all her family. They're probably rebels anyway, huh? <laughs> Anyways, it's good to see you, amigo. Good to see you. You know, you are a rare find. A gringo who is also a friend of our country. Bienvenido. We welcome you. Okay. Dad, relax, relax. I have some wonderful news for you. Quite wonderful. Good. Fact. You know the men you hunt? They have been captured in Chupa Rosa. I want you and DeSanta to ride out there, and then you can take possession of them. It is my gift to you, for all your help, senor. Although Good. part of me wishes that you would remain here and enjoy more of our hospitality, huh? <laughs> Thank you. If it's all the same, I'd like to collect the men. I have a wife and son at home whom I miss. Ah, don't we all, amigo? Don't we all? <laughs> the Santa, I want you to take care of senor Marston. <clears throat> Vámonos, cabrón, go! Adelante! <laughs> Mi amor! Mi amor! <laughs> All right. Me. A wagon has already been prepared. Good. Now I get the feeling that I'm going to get some funny business from the center. And I also get the feeling that they're more likely to be gone by the time I get there. Let's go. We have a long ride ahead of us. This is very good news, my friend. And I say the coronel will find this man for you. For your sake, you best be telling the truth. You have my word. After that trick you pulled on me with the munitions train, I ain't sure that means very much. You have Espinosa to blame for that. I'm now done. After everything we've been through, I think we can trust each other, don't you? How did you find it? They were captured just outside to Barossa. Every rat must come out of his hole eventually, being held in the church. A chance for them to contemplate having. Before you send them to hell, we have the area surrounded. Oh, cheer up, John. This is what you came for. You're so tense all the time. Come, let's have some fun. A little competition with my soldiers to see who's the best shot. What do you say? Anything better than talking to you. Ah, excellent. All right. Okay. Each man gets five shots at the local wildlife. Whoever kills the most, I will give twenty-five dollars. Carlitos, muestra le cómo se hace. No tienes ninguna posibilidad. Soy el mejor tirador de todo Nuevo Paraíso. Never tell anyone while you're hunting these animals. I guess it beats getting a real job. You know, if you were less sick of them, people might be more inclined to trust you. Are you married? Or do you break young girls like a curse? No, I could never touch a woman like that. It's not my way. And then, it's an honor to please the leader. My wife and child have been taken from me. That's why I have to find these men. I can sympathize with you, Senor Marston. I am married to my country. And these rebel traitors, they're trying to take it from me. I never took a wife. A woman can be a powerful force. Like my mother, or a destructive one. 
looked like my mother. I find it better to avoid them. So many strong men become weak by giving them to temptations of the flesh. Are you ready for an Bastu Carizales! Now you will see, gringo! So this means your time in Mexico is coming to an end. I hope so. You know, I will be sad to see you leave. No, you won't. You have helped many people. Just like Coronel Allende was able to offer you the skip in return. One brave man is another. Does your brave colonel ever leave his villa? I haven't seen him anywhere near a fight yet. He's the military commander, but he also governs the province. He must be protected, kept out of harm's way. Abraham Reyes, rebel leader? I hear he rides with his men. And how would you know that? Reyes is a coward, blinded by love for himself. All he does is write songs and poems about winning battles he's never fought in. Do we have one more? Molina, sing Go ahead, Momo. I can shoot the wings of my fly, senor. Sorry, Isn't this one? Don't you feel more relaxed? Sure. Whatever you say. You will when you have William Sun in the square. I believe it when I see it. Our men have been completely surrounded. There's nothing to worry about. Promise. Back to 20,000 pesos you promised when you sent me on a suicide mission with Espinosa? Yes. That's huh. been a busy time for you here, mate. What do you mean? I mean, you have built quite a reputation for yourself. Just following orders, Captain. So many stories of your brave exploits. Your actions will not be forgotten, compadre. Oh, I know. Oh, we're actually getting close. All I've done is shoot a load of birds down out from the sky for money. Wait. in the church it's a little too quiet here Mr. Maston, <laughs> gracias for your service to this land. Really? land enough I hope you have a clear conscience because you're about to meet God <laughs> really my brother they will kill you if you don't get your ropes off over here I will free you huh Well, that escalated quickly. Kinda glad I've been working both sides. Fuck you now. We will 
There we go. Oh, he's good. Don't you even dare try and rush me. Ooh, heal up a bit. Oh fuck! Damn it! Oh, I fucking think so. Stay down. A shame. I liked him. My brothers. <laughs> Today, we have proven that the days of this evil regime are numbered. Soon, we shall be free, living together in a noble republic, justly ruled by fine men. But, 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 el trabajo. The job is not done. Our struggle is not over. We will fight all day and night until local tyrants like Allende are no more. Hmm. And him and all his dogs are brought to the sword. We shall be free. This time things shall be different for every man and woman in this land! And, and one day, and one day soon, again they will know justice! My brothers, fight on! In our hearts, we are all free! Let us make it so! Viva la revolución! Viva Mexico! 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 Oh, let them celebrate. Let them have their fun. I cannot believe those asses. What? Bastards. Guess what though? DeSanta ran off like a little bitch. There's a question mark here. Let's go. Hey, 
Alto! Get over here! What's up, dude? Excuse me, sir. Excuse me. You are an American, are you not? Last time I checked. Oh, thank God, sir. Thank God. I have had it up to here with Dagos, up to here. The savages. <laughs> well, I do what I can to help. But this land was imagined by an angry God for an angry people. <laughs> Well, America ain't exactly a peaceful paradise, mister. Well, I mean, I tried, but... But at least you lot try to speak bloody English. Uh, this bloody lot... My God, if I'd wanted to speak Spanish, I'd have gone to Spain. Why didn't you? Oh, good question. Well, you know, <laughs> business, I suppose. Devil making work for idle hands, what? <laughs> now, uh, now, listen, friend. If you were to go west to Nosalida, I'd give you a reward for picking up a package of mine from the docks. Hmm? Well, there's, there's some fighting broken out there. Uh, it seems like it's more your kind of thing. Why would I want to do something like that? <laughs> Are you Americans mm -hmm. all the same? Obsessed with bloody money. Well, I will pay you, sir. I will give you a buck. Name's Tollitz, sir. Uriah Tollitz. They'll know of me in Nosalida. How much? Plenty, sir. Plenty. Uh, now you will take it and give it to the foreman of the estate at El Matadoro. He'll be expecting it. <laughs> Try to give those dagos hell. What? <laughs> oh, that's a fine fellow. Uh, a fellow countryman here. Okay, I'm here to escape them. Okie dokie, right. Uh, he said the docks, didn't he? Should have guessed by the bloody job name. Poppycock is another English term for bullshit. Or you're lying. <laughs> or what a load of old rubbish. Yeah, we do seem to have a way with words, we do. Whoa. I'm cutting out a bit fine.
Here we are. Ringo, we need your help. Take these two men and destroy that level camp. Got it. I'll go over and take this bit here. him dead good He's dead. Oh. God damn it. Right. No, I thought I was never going to die. Shit, I'm out of ammo. doing here oh I've got to destroy the place as well There we go. Mm. Absolute destruction, cuz why not? Very good, amigo. Now keep moving. Oh, 
Oh, got to take out the ships as well. literally ran in there. That's stupid. Gracias. You're a friend to Mexico. Here's a little money. A sign of my gratitude. Now we must leave. Yes. Didn't know that I've already killed one of his um, generals. But, you know, whatever. Oh look, that soon put it out quickly. No. Right. Let's come over and see our friend here. Tadero, where is he? Oh, come on! All the way over here. Oh well, let's go. Let's go. Yeah, I just killed one in a second in a command and yeah. <laughs> no, I just helped them burn a, a village down. You know, I'm starting to wonder is if Javier is actually one of the army now. bit more there we go yeah. really didn't fancy such a long ride mm. oh
I ain't getting involved. God, this is a long ride. Anyways, um, next game I'm hyped about playing again is the original Star Wars Battlefront 1 and 2. That was fantastic to play. It was when I was much younger. Looking, at, looking forward to see how it goes again. I'm not talking the um, downgrade by EA. I'm talking about the original from um, Lucas Arts Games. Definitely up for buying that as soon as it comes out. There we go. And then what I'll do, I'll help out Louisa on the way back. I've got the wrong fucking side, haven't I? Mister, I got a package for you from a Mr. Tollix. Oh, thank you so much, my friend. What was the delay? Trouble over in Nasalita. Army or rebels? <laughs> Politics, my friend, is for fools. Which is why we see so much of it down here. Land of morons. Gets in the way of real work. If you say so. Here's the money for Mr. Tollix. I'll get this to the workers right away. That's quite a sum. <laughs> Must be valuable stuff. You have no idea, Gringo. No idea. If you would have known, you would have kept it all yourself. <laughs> Holy shit. What the hell? Am I going back to Mr. Tullet's now, am I? I don't really trust him.
Oh, fuck. There you go. There we go. Get my fucking way, assholes. Hmm. Bless her manners. I really love what running around all the way across the island. Weren't as bad as um, Red Dead 2. Having to go through a couple of states in order to get to where you need to. But then there was a lot more action. Well, we're still going strong with half an hour to go. So, I'm not going to complain. Oh, there we are. And then we'll go and help Louisa. Wait out here for a moment. Back in a sec. I've got your there money. we go. Oh, thank you, sir. Thank you. I damn well knew you were the kind of chap to be trusted. A fine fellow, sir. Fine fellow indeed. Unlikely to run off and report me to the authorities. What? <laughs> report what, Tollitz? Well, the Dagos here don't appreciate the terrible needs we answer. Well, building a country's hard, sir. It's hard. I opium's nasty business, but it's necessary. Necessary. Opium? What do you mean you didn't even sneak a taste of that package? <laughs> Are you mad, sir? That's fine stuff. 
straight from Ongo Bongo Land somewhere. <laughs> you use me. Okay. Are you a moralist or just a fool? Both, I guess. We provide a much needed service for the railroad workers. To help ease the pain and loneliness, them being so far away from home and all that. <laughs> but there's nothing wrong with this. I've smoked it myself for years. <clears throat> uh, I can't be bothered with him for now. I'm going to go and help out Louisa and then I'll come back to him next week. I thought I left my horse over here. Hey amigo, you wanna make some money? No. Nope. I did leave my horse over there. <clears throat> right, this um There we go. Right, let's go and help out Louisa. And then we will um, finish off. Oh, it's failed. Why did it fail? Come on. Oh well. Just ride and one handed at the moment. Well, I'm having a drink. Ah. Here we are. Oh. This is where our house used to be. Hey, Senor. You want trouble, friend? Manos arriba. Antilas. The hell? Tranquilo. <clears throat> Tranquilo, amigo. <laughs> Tranquilo. Ya lo tengo. Mueve ese cabrón. ¿Mm? Mueve <laughs> El mundo es muy difícil. Tenemos que jugarlo bien. Ah, oh, Mr. Marston. I knew you would come. Thanks for the welcoming committee. I'm sorry. We cannot be too careful. The world is very dangerous. Especially when you greet it with a gun. Please. Uh, where do you want... Mr. Marston. My father was killed yesterday. The army found him and accused him of treason. They cut out his heart and fed it to their dogs. Allende yeah, did lovely. Then he took the honor of two young girls. I'm sorry to hear that, Louisa. My father must not die in vain. His death must mean something. 
It'll mean that war is brutal and unnecessary and good people die. And that's all it will mean. That is not enough. Well, you know I'll do whatever I can, but I have problems of my own. We all have problems. This is about the people. My father died for his people. For these men and for millions like them, that they may be free. While there are guns and money, there won't be any freedom, Louisa. Mr. Marston, the movement is on the brink of great victory. Allende knows this and has sent for reinforcements. Abraham Reyes asked personally that you stop them reaching Escalera. They are coming by the old trail. You must ambush them. I have my own family to worry about. Mr. Marston, I have lost my father. My mother is in the United States. My sister has fled. I have no family. Just because. Please. Good actions make you a good man. Then I'm doomed. But I will help you. Out of respect for your loss. Thank you, Mr. Marston. Thank you. Let's go. We do not have much time to prepare the ambush. Ah, oh, cool. I'm riding shotgun. Nice. You can ride with me on the wagon or follow on your horse. I'm sorry about your father. His death must not be in vain. Now we shall fight even harder to win power for Abraham. I admire your devotion. He is a true revolutionary. A man who puts the needs of others before his own. A man who fights out of love rather than hate. But you know this already. I heard about the battle at Chuparrosa. How he killed nearly a hundred soldiers to save your life. It'll go down in legend. I'm sure of that. Can I trust you, Mr. Marston? In what way? You have done so much for me and my family, but I still can't forgive you for helping Allende, for what you did to the rebels. I'm here for two men, that's it. Not to take sides. And certainly not to fight a war that isn't mine, that makes no sense. You make a choice by not making a choice, you know. Allende betrayed me. I saw him do bad things. Things that disgust even me. Allende is pura maldad. One day I will cut his heart out. With me? You? Him? We're all shooting people. Don't really seem like we're so very different. The difference is why, Mr. Marston. The ideals we hold, there can never be revolution without blood. Until people forget what they're shooting for, and just enjoy killing for its own sake. You Americans forget too quickly. That is the problem. Mm. It wasn't for your revolution. We'd still be making tea for the English. At least we knew where we stood. It's more difficult to understand why your own people treat you like shit. It is the same here. We fought off the Spanish. We fought off the French. We even fought off the Americans. Finally, Mexico won its independence. And all we've done since then is fight each other. At least you're keeping up tradition. It will end when Abraham takes control. When the Spanish left, we renamed this province Nuevo Paraíso. New Paradise. One day, it will live up to its name. Why do you doubt our revolution so much, Mr. Marston? I guess I can't pretend to understand your country's politics. But you think we are fighting for nothing? Take no notice of me. I ain't got much faith in power just now. That is exactly why we must continue to fight for change. Nothing ever really changes. You are a man who has lost his spirit. No doubt. I once believed it was possible to make a difference. The men I'm chasing, they did too. Then, if we spilled enough blood, we can change the way people think. Revolutions are always won with blood. And after the fighting's done? Freedom. We ain't never free. Be honest with yourself, and you will be free. That must be what I've been getting wrong all these years. Oh. <clears throat> Everything you could. They know nothing of my father's death. I feel terrible, but it isn't safe for them here anymore. After we win, they can return to a new Mexico. And what about you? I will stay and fight. I am ready to die if necessary. Emilio, too. We are a close family. 
Do you have children, Mr. Marston? I have a son at home and a daughter in heaven. Is he looking after your wife? I hope so. Oh, He's no not way. much younger than you, but <laughs> I don't know. He's still young. We tried to protect him, give him a gentler childhood than what we had. Guess I failed at that. What is his name? Jack. Jack Marston. I ain't been much of a father. We tried to hide the bad from him growing up, but he saw things he shouldn't. Children see more than you think. That's what I'm worried about. I don't want him to become a man like me. Hmm. It is not far now. The army convoy will be coming from the east. We going to steal their supplies? No. Destroy them and kill everyone. Abraham wants to send a message. Do you have experience with explosives? A little. It's been a long time. Good. Because we do not. You will man the detonator. My men are waiting there for Oh, us. we're gonna blow we shit up. Nice. Setting up the dynamite. I'll do my best. We will do this for my father, John. There they are. These men will help you rig dynamite on the road. Please tell them where to place it. I'll be waiting up above, watching for the wagons. Okay, follow me, gentlemen. Vamos, tell us where to place it. Right. Press triangle, mark a location for the dynamite. Oh, okay. Very one right here. Another one here. And that may cause a chain reaction, you know. Another one here. Set the last one here. Good. Now go. Luisa is waiting for you at the top of the hill. Hmm. <clears throat> oh, I hope I did that right. If not, that would be very embarrassing. I was thinking of bringing the bridge down on them. They are coming. Get ready, John. Abraham is counting on us. We cannot disappoint him. There it is. Get ready. No. I'll take whatever in front out. And let the rest fold. Oh, finally. Jesus, they were slow. <laughs> It'll be next week by the time they get there.
Got him. What were we gonna? We are a step closer to power. My father would be very proud. I hope it was worth it. I must return to Campo Mirada. Meet me there when you can. I will do my best to return the favor. Time to get back to camp. Whoa. Let's go. Oh, I'm literally here. do for this week if you enjoyed the stream consider following um, at the moment I'm only streaming once a week I want to find something else to stream as well on a different night but that'll be one for later until then I mean I'm also on YouTube uh, you can follow me there at Asbo Gaming where I'm streaming Cyberpunk 2077 on there and I'm also uploading Self Park and the Stick of Truth and Dying Light number one. Anyways, despite the technical issues, we finally got through it. Any of you that joined, thanks for joining me. Hope you enjoyed and catch you in the next one.